you can see down in the rain. We're absolutely soaked. This is Bristol, but I think. Why? Legend on his way down. Ooh. That goes right the way down. Call it no fit for that. Oh, this looks old, old school. God, this this looks like a cell. Look out there, we can work out where we are. How far we are underneath. Oh my god. <laughs> little things to look in. Maybe they didn't trust the banks and they didn't want people knowing how much money they had. God, we're up here now on the rooftops. I don't think you can really see, to be honest. That's why I wish I'd had a slightly better phone tonight, but that wasn't going to happen. <laughs> we should be able to see in the dark now, but uh, yeah, it's raining and we're trying to get over there. But we've had to come across. Ooh, shit. See, there's buildings and drops and all sorts. Of stuff. So we're going to get across these roofs and we're going up, up there. So we're with Mad Bastard in the dark, number one. <laughs> And another mad bastard in the dark, number two. We'll find out who they are later on. So here we are now, we're in. And there's there's a little, uh, whatchamacallit, trap door. But if you open it, you can see down. There's a rat then. I saw a rat run down the, um, the, the banister. So look, that's, that's straight down. And it looks, it looks abandoned. Those the floor steps look really manky. A mess on those. Mm -hmm. Here's some mad bastards going up a ladder. There you go, you can just about see them. <laughs> In the rain, we're absolutely soaked. This is Bristol, but oh yeah, we worked out who it is yet. We worked out who's. Mad enough to be up on the roofs tonight. I need bloody any waterproof underpants, I think. Why? Well, hey. I better turn the light off. Here we go. View of Bristol. Focus. View from up the top. Ladders. And let's go. Ooh, ooh look in there. this okay, sketch it up there in the rain no, no easy way yeah I guess maybe that window's open there okay um, cool well you gotta be mad to be up here tonight on the top of the roof. You can drop it down. There he goes. Into the darkness. Oh, by the way, we're trying to get up there where we think. That might be a stairs. Legend on his way down, down, down. There we are, look. Bristol. Drops, Ugh, horrible. It drops over there. It's scary. That looks like St. Nicholas Market over there. Is that the roof? The market? Oh, wow, okay. There's no locks on these windows, so they just slid up. It's pretty mad, and I'll just show you now that one's open. 
but there's no there's no locks they just they just sit there so yeah so I guess now we can introduce the Jessmeister and Sam Sam I am Woo! Did you rip your Oh, that's all right. Okay. Oh. Me over over the years, little bastards. <laughs> that was before YouTube. Now the pleasure is all mine. <laughs> Can I give you to that back to hold whilst I just put this on a bag a sec? Because I can't stop. Just put it down. Once you start, once you pop, you can't stop. It's wet. It's wet. That's not too bad. That did keep it dry with that bit. Okay. Cool. Right, let's have a look around. Yeah. Oh. So, we have absolutely no real idea where we are. No. Should we close that window in case we don't come back this way? I don't oh. mind, mate. Sorry. Yeah, I'd leave a little gap at the bottom, but it might be advantageous. You never know, because we might fucking... Hmm. Hello, secret vault. What are you doing here? Hmm. So, an old fireplace. Looks like we've, we've had to climb into the gods, as we used to say in Wales. You climb into the gods, which is a, a, a term we used to use for height. So, we are now in the gods. Ooh. I'm just going to clean my glasses. Right. Yes. Looks like some sort of office building. Not too bad, really. I mean, if they put a bit on the ceiling, it could be used for storage and stuff. Oh, bloody hell. Whoa. There's a hole in the floor there. I didn't even see that. They're not bad little rooms, really. Where we were, we pushed against. We pushed against this. So we're like, oh, I wonder if we can get in here. I don't think somehow. But see, that's a stupid thing because they've done all that there, and the bloody window was open. And my camera is not on now. The bloody thing's gone off. Bollocks. abandoned place and how could it be somewhere that's this abandoned in the central Bristol wow gold oops a daisy gold on the fireplaces wow goodness gracious the floors are a bit up and down, aren't they? I bet you we could get out here. out into the madness. Bonkers, mate. Bonkers. Just 
just coming through. But I uh, wonder where, whether this goes anywhere useful. Anyway, useful. There's people down there working, playing on his phone. Cool. I like it. So we're very close to where we want to be, which is the next building along Vata Way behind us now. Um, but we're pretty close. Not bad. And if push comes to, sh come to shove, we might be able to get out here, up over the top and out further, I don't know. What you, what you want to do is have a look at the street, street map view on Google Maps and um, see whether or not the edge of this building, which is along there, you know, if we were to jump up and go over, because inside the complex, which is, behind, is over there, that's all hollow, isn't it? But on the street side, it goes all the way down, it's a front. So I reckon we could get up over the top, but it's going to be a bast... Mm. I think it's all connected. Jeez, well, if, if it is, we're in business. It's just the back side of the building, as we get to the main bit. Mm. So That's weird. Maybe more buildings were joined in the past. can things like this just be abandoned in the most affluent areas of central Bristol? Look at this. I just find it amazing, mind-blowing, stuff like this. I mean, you know, it's not, it's not bringing them any money in. I'd live in somewhere like this. I wouldn't care about the state of it. I'd just be happy to live in it. They've got bars on the windows now, that might be because there's something to do with the status of this place being to do with... Oh look there, it's danger, do not enter. This is an old lift shaft perhaps. I wonder if that's a lift shaft. That might have been buttons, that might be a lift shaft there, I don't know. Mm. Absolutely mental. Chess coming. She. Oh, there she is. You're just waiting for the alarms to go off, aren't you? <laughs> I know you are. You just send Matt down first. <laughs> it's quite uh, interesting. Oh, yeah, that's a blue mark, isn't it? Mm. This is a mad little building. We've got uh, stained glass windows now. Sort of Victorian building, perhaps. All that sort of stuff. Oh. I love these little steps up into like different floors as well. Whoa! What is that? What the hell is this? Danger, do not enter, but what is it? Oh my god! That goes right the way down! Oh my god! So, what the hell was this then? This must have been a lift or maybe to bring up goods. Very heavy goods, perhaps, these two. This isn't, by any chance, this is not the, um, the Guild Hall building, is it? No, it's next door. 
mm. like style. Because I can imagine a guild hall, if they were trading things, might have had something like that, perhaps. But uh, goods, you know, guilds trading things. What's going on here? Then? Again, it's very strange. Why would they have this type of design on the windows here when it doesn't seem to match? Well, upstairs is a lot more fancy than this, but this one is just very basic. Oh, it doesn't want to open. But it's, uh, it just seems like an unusual design. Everything must have had a very, very important reason why they designed it this way. So we've got, uh, wow, look at this. The colours in that. We've got another one of these do not enters. Oh, look at this. Big old cupboard. Wow, it was just used for envelopes and... Oh, it's annoying. You forget you're meant to be somewhere and do so many things. Hmm, doesn't quite want to... Oh, you've got to do that first. Gold Medal Eagle, the Great, 1897. There you go. Turn of the century. And it, what's it say on there as well? Gold Medal Eagle Great by, by Royal Letters Patent. Royal Letters Patent, my God. That is a nice bit of kit. Mmm. Again, you know, it's part of this mad old building, which is just lying, lying in waste. Mm -hmm. Watch, this looks like this pipe may be live, dead. <laughs> okay, whatever. This pipe. A secret Bristol, really. So we're right in the centre of town, and uh, let's get a nice little shot of these. Uh, it's the stair, the stair work. So it looks like there's a fire escape here, and there's some sort of electrical wiring, but I can't see any alarms or anything on it. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> Not much of a fire escape, I know, is that? Oh my god, I think we've got some big rooms. So we can go down, or we come in here. Look how big this is. It's like a bloody dance hall or something. Wow. And... How far are we from the bottom now? Not that far. God alive, this is this is crazy this place. Oak, oak door. Don't really know where these are going. Outdoors. 
where that leads. It's quite dark out there, so I think we're probably alright. I wonder, I wonder if out here somewhere. Can't see anything. Bloody hell. I was going to say, maybe this would be the way to get out in that direction for where we want to go. What does it say? Rubbish only in here, nothing for Fairfax Street. Oh, look at this. Did you see this? Cheers. Let's have a couple more rooms to have a quick look at. If I shine the light out there, see if you can see anything. It's just that it's opaque, the glass is opaque. I think it's actually been done like that to stop people looking in. It is actually opaque glass. Hmm. And I wonder where these go. This looks like a way in, way out. Oh, please close the door. But where does the door go to? Might be, yeah. I want to see where we are. Yeah, we're at street level now. View. So, this can be a way in and out. I can't see any alarms on it. it looks like an electrical thing. There's people walking past. Is this some sort of. This is an alarm thing, isn't it? There is a bolt across there, look. Chub lock. So I don't think that's going to open. Nah. That won't open unless you open the other side. You open this handle and open both doors at the same time. And then you could, you could push them closed again. So it'd be a way to come back in. <laughs> so it might be worth... Um... I've opened the thing, so if we ever want to come back, we just... This is. So this is the Guild Hall then. Yeah, I wonder if it was because I mean, big rooms like that. Control and records. Where does it say Guild Hall? Guild Hall, Bristol, Health and Safety. So, bloody hell. Now this must be the basement then. Because we're at street level already, so this is the basement. I wonder if it goes into you know where. Oh my god, it might, you know. It might, it might. Oh yes, go on, please find something interesting now. So we're underground now. Old toilets, perhaps? Oh, it's a big old safe door, is it? Yeah. No way! <gasps> now this is going to be... If we keep going that way, we're going to end up under the street. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh my God. Oh my God. What the hell? What the hell have we got here? Let's get back. It's a bit deep, that does, as we go in. I mean, what the hell is this? What's all this? Oh, for picking up stuff. Oh, 
I think that that's a slanted slanted um, chute. Mm -hmm. This is a coal bunker. They chuck coal in from the street, mm -hmm. and they just drop down here into the bunker, yeah. and then they do something with picking it up here. And it's quite dark walls. So, and, and it says exit swing handle to the left. No way. Do you want to find out what it does? A bit drippy there. You don't reckon? Swing handle to the left, it says. Maybe it's been sealed in some other way. Yeah. The way this is traces of where the ceiling may have gone. Look, you're seeing marks there. It might have been a, another a different run to the ceiling, but. Mm. So we've got Oops, sorry mate. Well this looks like a bunker bunker door. That's the toilet that's just a toilet -y area. Yeah, it looks like an old door, is it? Oh my god. Metal cage on the other side. It's a metal cage out there, is it? Yeah. Mm. Where does that face though? Wow, oh, they don't want people getting in here. They do not want to get in here for some reason. Oh. Let's go through the bunker door then. Look at this. I assume this is where they've gone. Now this looks like it's going from building to building. Can't even hear them now. This is... Wow. They're not in here yet. Oh, it doesn't go anywhere, it's blocked up. It would have gone somewhere, but it's been blocked up. Oh, look at this. This probably wasn't here either. So this is the confines of another building. Mm. Well, look at that for thin. Go anywhere then. I can hear them down here, but I don't know where they are. Oh, they're down here. Hmm. Did you go through the bunker thing? It, it got, narrows down and becomes a dead end. Toilets and a lot of plumbing down here. This must be at the bottom then. There's another little room there. I don't think it goes anywhere. Mm. So this is the um, the lift shaft then that would have gone up. I don't know whether that was a lift, an actual lift, or or something else. It might have been a very old-fashioned Victorian lift that you know you're not allowed to use, sort of thing. Mm -hmm. But uh, here we go. There's the base of it. So that's the stairs where we came in. What's that then? That then slides down again. Wow! Look at the pipework. And there, there does seem to be areas that have been bricked off in some of these bits. So. Mm. I can 
can hear the street up there. It's almost like steps. It's like one, two, three. Three steps. Ooh. Ooh. Some cobwebs. Just keeps on going. Oh, well, yeah. That went somewhere once. It doesn't go there now. This is a labyrinth, isn't it? There's stairs back up around here, so I don't know maybe how far along we are there. Could you get a GPS fix and through a window, you know, to kind of find out where we are? Oh yeah, yeah. But this is a real labyrinth, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Jess says she found something, I don't know what it is. Mm -hmm. Dead ends. Dead ends. Look at that. That's a dead end, there's nothing in there. There's nothing in there, apart from pipes. Oh, is the stairs going? Let's have a quick look. Ooh, it's a dead, the stairs are dead. They don't go anywhere. They did. Let's have a quick look. So they, they bricked here. It's probably where things went. I didn't see this. Oh my god, no, we haven't been down here. Danger, keep out. Ooh. Now there's nothing lit up in here. And the disc is not moving in that. So I think all the electrics here are actually off. <laughs> Spooking yourself out now. No, oh right. god. Which one? You might have to do it. Yeah, those are those are jammed in, aren't they? Yeah. Do you think it's because um Needs to be, if you kick from your way, kick, kick from your direction. Oh yeah, there we go. Does that release it? Bloody hell, how the hell did they jam them like that? Oh, I tell you what they've done. They've locked it and they've slammed it at high speed. Yeah. Bloody idiots. Vaulted ceilings here. So we've got to work out where we are, really. Yeah. Oh, this looks old, old school. God, this this looks like a cell. Look at that on the door. Oh my God! Hang on. Look, a wash basin. Wash basin room. Look at this on the door. Look at that. It's spooky. That's a great going up to street level. Yeah, it goes straight up to great level. Look, look, look. Is this, would it be a to see who's there before you open the door, secret door, yeah, or cells. Yeah. 
Bloody hell. This place just goes on and on and on. So we've got If somebody could get a signal on their phone, the GPS, to work out where we are. If somebody could get a signal on their GPS out there, we could work out where we are. How far we are underneath. Oh my god! Oh my god! We hit the mother load. Oh my god. That's the mechanics, isn't it? That's the door mechanism. This is the vault. This is a vault then. No wonder they, no wonder they had a little a hatch on that window to see. Oh, that's the thing that was... I wonder where they could kick it outwards and get it open. No. It's properly jammed. But yeah, this was a, this was a vault. The secret vault. This is the secret vault. And we're in secret vault. This is what you came here for. Look, this is it. Secret vaults. Keys. Mm. Can't move it, can you? Just move it a bit. Wait, always got to move this up. It's to stop it moving, is it? Stop it swinging. Yeah. But, um, you know, you've got little things to look in, glass to look in, and this is the mechanism for this, which is like, wow. Mechanism for the door. What's happened with this? Oh, I see, they've, that's not moving. And they don't want that moving. This, they must have had a lot of money or something in this place. Maybe they used to keep their own gold or money here. It is the guild hall. It's the guild hall. Obviously, maybe they didn't trust the banks and they didn't want people knowing how much money they had. Maybe they used to keep people's money here for them and trust like a bank. Maybe they were, oh my God. Maybe they were like a bank. Oh, this is weird because the screws going into the wall implies that there's, these are screwed on metal plates. Yep, they're all screwed on metal plates. Screwed onto what? I don't know, but... God, this is, this is just bizarre. All this was here, and it's Hobbs and Co. made the locks apparently. These are, <coughs> it's mad, isn't it? They all contract from all the corners. It looks like sort of everyone chung 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 chung. It's like locks each corner, like lock at the bottom, lock at the top, lock on the sides. All corners, mad. Central pin, try the outer one. Mm. Try the handle, try the little handle down the side. And again. And again. I can't really see, that doesn't seem to do anything. Mm. 
mystery. The mystery of the guild hall locks. Keys, three keys look you needed. One, two, three. So do we know where this stairs goes? Blocks. Oh it's blocked, is it? Taking the door out, we could cut it off there. But, uh, let's go and have a quick look then. Oh yeah, it's blocked off at floor level. Wow. So there were lots of ways down here in the past. Now not so many. Look at the mechanism on that. Again, all the bars that would have gone in, look. Bar, bar, bar. It's a heavy duty lock. Well, I'm state overstating the obvious there. Hmm. <laughs> So we've been in, I think we've been in those. That's out to the street. That's the mains room. Is there any bits down here we haven't seen yet? Clean white room, nicely whitewashed. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we've been down here, haven't we? That's the street. Yeah. I wonder whether we can get a GPS. Oh no, sorry. I was thinking it was the other room, the one that actually you could see the the bars above. I wonder if we held our phones for long enough whether we'd get a slight GPS signal. Just up the phone. To do it where we can see the sky because it's line of sight isn't it? No, we've just come down. This is the way we just come isn't it? Yeah. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way to the street. I'm still not getting my orientation for which way's out. <laughs> you might. Oh, can you see the sky? You can just about see the sky up there. Drippers in the eye. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Like you are under you are under the street. Yeah, when it when it's not sure about it, it normally has a big blue circle around it saying like I'm not sure. But that's saying it knows where we are, so it's probably the side of the road. This is this is where we were. That's where we wanna be, is it? This is where we started here. Hmm. We're on the other side of the road. Yeah. Oh no, now we're back here. Oh. Don't know where we are, does where, it? Where, oh, we're gone. Where, oh, it's probably um, anything that we can see hmm, that's got. Uh, we'll have to have a look for it later on. Uh, if we take a notice of the fact that there's two pieces of wood there mm -hmm. across, across the thing, well, that'll be a good clue for us. It's quite, um, quite quiet, really, isn't it? Yeah. Right, so what's, what's the visual sign on this one then? Anything? It's a white edge of the building though. White painted. Just make sure I've got any drippers. I've got a few actually. Let's just give me my lens. I think I'm recording. I hope I bloody am. Wouldn't that be funny? Oh, he didn't record. <laughs> Mr. Dixon will probably be interested in this one. Mm. He said, do you know what he said to me as well? He said, keep the end of the month free because um, Steve Ronin's coming oh, right. down. 
probably ever gonna do this and be able to see that phone because they took it to the Green Apple. Yes. Yeah, that was pretty mad. Yeah, that's crazy. It's a long way back now. So So we must be under the guild hall again now, because that's the lift shaft. Yeah. So I wonder if the street goes that way. If we go up and look at the orientation of the lift shaft when we go up here. Okay, because that, that stuff we've seen goes out that way, doesn't it? Mostly that way, mm -hmm. so it goes that way. So when we go up here, Let's see if we can orientate ourselves to see. So the tunnels mostly go that way. Ah. So yeah. So at the bottom of the shaft, tunnels all go that way. Although that doesn't quite look no I can't see the bottom there but so would this be out into a side lane I think we've actually blocked these up they've actually blocked up the fire exits it's an amazing room though. Alright, I'm going to have a look on my phone in a minute, so I'm going to turn off the camera for a minute. I'm just trying to work out how we can get out. Oh, hello. That opens. Wow. Pretty serious, um, pretty serious uh, doodahs. Hang on, let me turn this light off so we can see a better way. Let's open this up. There you go. It's pretty serious um, railings. Oh. Can you get round them? Let me get out and have a look. Do you want to push the window open a bit more? ground level now and this means that down where we were this is the underground level more of where we were in the on there's no way up there's no way to get across those um, rails is there unless you're absolutely desperate but it's not that would not be easy That's where we want to be, I think, is the courts next door. Nothing? There is. Oh, cool. All right, thanks for that. See ya. <laughs> That'll teach you being all helpful and friendly. <laughs> this is Urbex, it's every man for himself, isn't it? Like, run away and leave your friends. You can see it right there. Cool. Should we get this down? Go. Oh. 
go up. Upstairs, though, yeah. up on this side. Yeah, this side. Oh, sorry. On this side. So that must have been to other offices when they were joined. And this way is locked. Right then. Oops, it is. The rain is not helping, is it? Somebody's house over there. He's in his lounge, look, and uh, I mean, like, <laughs> what, what? That's nuts. How the hell's he got a nice? He's not. He's not doing something dirty, is he? He's on his bed, look. Let's be looking into somebody's bedroom. He's playing on his PlayStation. Ironworks Supply Company, car, uh, bar, apparel, blah blah blah. Oh. 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 Trapped. Maybe it didn't join. But we could go across the next floor up and along that, that front. Hmm. Where the what? Sorry, the what? I don't think so, no. Because the top floor is where we came in, isn't it? Oh, I wonder if the roofs join. I wonder if the roof space is joined. Because that's quite often you get little crawls through the roof. Ah, that would be a nut one, nutty one. They they block everything else, but they leave the roofs. Houses was like that. I could go down into the neighbour's house through my attic. No. Nope. An awesome squat, this. Well, we can get out onto the, uh, the thing. We can get out onto the, the front bit if you think it's worth it. But it's one of those, I think once we get up there, we ain't coming back. Shit or bust. Gosh, smells some nice food out here. <laughs> it smells of food. It's not going to be easy, but it could be doable. Now, if, we're gonna, if, we, if we don't know we're going to be coming back this way, so we might as well pull the thing too. I wonder if we go up again. Back up the stairs, to the top floor. Well, does this join or does it, does it join? We're on top of the, the, the way the floors would have gone, so the roof wouldn't go through, would it? The, um, the attics wouldn't join. The attics, I don't think they join. But this would be a flat, flat thing across the top of the roof, perhaps. Mm. Tell you what, do you want to hold on to this a sec? Thank you. 
Yeah, be careful, mate. Yeah, it's proper sketching it. Might be able to find a plank or a chair or something maybe. Oh, we'll, have to, we'll have to work something out because I think that would be a one way trip as well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Have a look at my phone at street maps a minute. I'm going to steal the chair. Uh, right, to turn the foot, turn the camera off a minute. Right. right, this is absolutely mental. Right, we are by a window, yeah, and this window drops down onto the street. But guess who we got through the window? Have a look. Have a look who we got out here. It's not Jimmy Savile, by the way. Right. Yeah, somebody's house is over there. Look. That's their house. Look, there she is. That's her. That's her kitchen. Where is it? That's her kitchen. You can see on the left hand side. In a microwave. That's her lounge. She lives on the top floor. I mean, that is just an amazing place to live. I mean, the view alone. And she's in one of the most exclusive parts of Bristol here. And we're just climbing all over the roofs outside her. Outside her well, not outside hers, we're, we're opposite, but we're not connected to, so we're not actually on her bit. But we're gonna go over there now. Mm -hmm. I wish my, I wish this bloody phone would be brighter. I mean, it's really crap. But anyway, there we are, look. Now we're gonna get out there now, in a minute. It's all getting out now, look. Well, it's a bit darker on that camera. So there he is. And here's the edge, and we've got to get to that building and up through that window there. So we get to focus. Come on, you bugger. Here we are. It's better. Right, so there's a ladder. There's a ladder that goes up there, and we're going to get in through that open window. Look. See, it's open. But this is the sketchiest bit. This is like a leap of faith, right? Check this out. We've got to get off here onto this edge, across onto that bit there, and then down. So we've got to step off one thing onto another. Realize my steady shot was on on my camera, and you're not supposed to use steady shot and the gimbal, because they can kind of freak out a bit, but it's off now, but I'm going to do handheld. I'm, I'm, I'm doing... Uh, yeah, hold, 
is um, that side, mm -hmm. the side that faces the court isn't boarded. Um, only it's like tinted windows. Yeah. So they might see the lights going off. Um, well, fuck I it. think once we're in there, yeah. it's a bit late then, isn't it? Still. No, you wouldn't. Be, you wouldn't expect it. Would you? No, you yeah. wouldn't even look. Would you? Uh, we've got used to the dark, though. Yeah, that's She's right. Herself, into, uh, she is having a drink. I shouldn't have had that. Those coffees keeps making me need a. <laughs> <laughs> what can you say now? <laughs> I have to bleep these out. Yeah. <laughs> Talk about PPs. <laughs> yeah. Right. So this is the deal. Right. Check this out, folks. Honestly. Right, we've just done some legendary crap here. It may not look high, but if you imagine, right, you just you just put yourself in our position, right? There's the street, and that ledge there, we just to get down from that ledge by getting onto this, sliding down the edge of this, yeah? I'll give you a little example of what we were just up to. I wish we could have filmed it, but we were all hands on deck, unfortunately. We had to dangle legs on there, legs on there, and come down, and that's nuts. And uh, I didn't think I could do it. And then when I did it, you didn't think you could do it. <laughs> and when you did it, you didn't think you could do it. And then we, we basically, we all really surprised ourselves here, I think. <laughs> it's just nuts. <laughs> Adrenaline. So we're doing a bit of old uh, Dan Dixon camera. We up. I don't know, but it it's um, two bits of wire, I don't know. I wouldn't touch it if I were you. I have no idea what that is. But what we're going to do is get in up there. Oh, she's turned her lights off over there. Do you think she's gone? So this is the deal then, right? We are, we are exactly where we wanted to be. Oh yeah, she's downstairs now. She's like, look at this. And anyway, we'll tell you the big reveal then. This is the Magistrates Court of Bristol. It's not in use anymore. Don't know why, but we're gonna give it a go. Oh, no way down. don't say that. Because I think we're going to have a hell of a job trying to get back up there. You should have this way. What, what's the deal up there then? It's just a floor, it's a wooden floor. But there's no way down, there has to be. There has to be. Because I don't think they'd build a, a room like that if there wasn't. I'm gonna to have to see this bloody camera now is lighting up when I'm climbing up and I don't want that woman to see. I've got to go and check this out because I reckon there's going to be a way in there. Jeez. Sorry folks, this is a bit nuts. So what the hell? We got a pigeon hanging on by its feet. We've got this walkie thing here. Where does it go down to? I don't know. I don't know if it does go down. What's this?
Oh, maybe it doesn't go down. Maybe it's just a feature. It's a feature. But there are, there's a ladder on this side though that might be useful. That does go down to other things. And there's a door there, look. There's a door there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell him to come up. I'll tell him to check out all the way down there, but I reckon this is it. I'm gonna turn the camera off a minute because it's just easier. This is like right up on top of a part of Bristol they don't want you to see. So I'm just gonna turn on to a really low light. Jess coming in, look. My bag's on the floor there. This is a sketchy old ladder. Wooden ladder. It's got mounds of pigeon shit. Oh my god. Actually, I could slip on the pigeon shit if I'm not careful. Whoa! Don't be a dickhead now. There's mounds of pigeon shit up here. Ugh. This shouldn't be off. This 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 ladder thing shouldn't be open like this because it's putting all Oh my god, we've done it. We are on top of the Magistrates Court in Bristol. We're on top of it. Oh yeah. That's disgusting getting up there. Look, we're right on top of it all, folks. Higher than the church. Wow. And with that, I've now got to climb down the pigeon poop again. A serious pigeon poop. Look at that. Half a pigeon poo. The thing is, some idiot has taken this off. And now, that's what results as the bloody ladder's getting knackered, so I'm going to pull that back now, properly. Here they come, walking down the street. Da -da 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 -da. And there's a broken, well it's broken everything up here actually. There's bits to get down onto, some mad, mad old bits of roof down there. Hang on, it's all steamed up I think. Mm-hmm, hang on. Bits down there, bits over there. What I'm mostly interested in is this bad boy here. What's in there then? Don't say there's nothing. Ah, oh. that's a lift shaft. That's an old lift. It's old lift equipment. That's a lift drop beneath there. They've taken the lift out. Oh, there's no window, but I bet it's a drop in there. Bloody grim old place though. 